Good morning, everybody. The vlog is starting early. I need to plug in my work laptop. Because our van gets delivered today. I also had to move our car because street cleaning is still happening in Chicago. And we were parked in a spot it was going to get cleaned. But I made the dire mistake of walking half a mile to an old parking spot to realize the car wasn't there. Positive. I got Sarah and James a scone. And I got myself a cup of coffee. But then I had to walk a mile in the opposite direction to get the car to move it to a spot where it won't get towed. Anyway, we're like two hours <laughs> away from the van being dropped off. I can't wait. Where we got engaged over there. Look at this space. big old car. There's so many gadgets and gizmos. Look at this. Do they call it a moonroof or a sunroof? I think it's a sunroof, but I think the moonroof is the third row. But we've got basically three panes of glass because this one opens up. Mm -hmm. That one stays. That one doesn't open. It just stays to look through. Then the one in the back doesn't open up, but you can just look through it. And this is automatic. I'm gonna find, I think I'm gonna try to turn around and come by the Drake. Mm -hmm. Maybe we can park there and both of us can explore and look at it and stuff. Yeah, we, uh, Peter's on his lunch break, so we got some time. A little bit of time before my next meeting and we figured we probably shouldn't be showing you outside of our apartment while we <laughs> right. do this. A so little bit of privacy. A little joy ride to make sure, like, cause it's got like, say Peter's like lane departure, which is kind of creepy cause it like, I tried to force it just now on Lake Shore Drive and it like auto-corrected the car and I was like, ugh, robots. <laughs> We are parked. I'm gonna show you our car. Let me show you. <laughs> Sarah is nice and reclined. The third row actually reclines. Oi. The third row, and I'm gonna ask so Sarah cool. in a moment yeah. to get out of there because I wanna show you the stolen go option. Mm -hmm. But that's like the amazing. That's why our baby is asleep. <laughs> Look at this. We got TVs on both seats, and they've got like, you can do. You can actually HDMI USB headphones to get like a computer, a uh, video game system. There's a Blu-ray DVD player in the front. There's apps. Are we there yet? <laughs> um, and then that folds down. You've got a remote. Our kids won't be forward seating for a while, but like it's still. We got this for like a like a yeah. decade long plan. Yes, we're gonna use this car. I already tracked the leaves in. Does this? Oh, look, I think the mat, so this is the stone go option. I think the mat stays there. So you pull this, press that button there, and it moves the driver's seat into the proper position that you need it in to easily do stone and go. You pull the latch up. Look at, first of all, look at all that storage. How many pops can I put in there? How many Mickey Premium Bars can I smuggle into that after an after hours event? Right. And then, stone and go. Boom. Whoa. Yeah. Wow. Look at that. Woo. Look at all that space. Yeah. Oh, the vacuum. The vacuum. So. Yes. So that's another cool thing. Vacuum while our baby's sleeping. <laughs> Such an awesome sleeper, it doesn't even matter. Stow and go. Stow vacuum. For our car, for when I spill chips everywhere. This was our priority. That was our priority. And what else was our priority? Really the stow and go. Like, yeah, those were like when I heard about the vacuum, that. There's one other thing. The yeah. sunroof. Yeah, that was. That sunroof was, was a nice one. Definitely up Oh, good mileage. Yeah, yeah. like low, low starting mileage. Like now I'm gonna bring the seat out and then I'm gonna go in the back and show you the stow and go for the back. All right, we just got this open. 
and uh, we want to show you stone gold. First of all, look at that depth. Like <laughs> it, this is where the bugaboo is going to live, basically, yeah. when we're not using it. Mm. That's the stone vat that where you like clean it out. Cool. <laughs> <laughs> but that makes sense. <laughs> And over here we got this cool this is option. This literally the first time we're looking at this. Yeah. Normal, stow, forward, backward, right, both. So we're gonna hit stow. Whoa! Uh oh, that's, that's deep up as connected. I think that's okay. Look at this. Ayo. You can disconnect that seatbelt. Yeah. Well, I've seen videos of like it being connected still. Oh, really? So okay. there is, so like imagine us driving to Florida in January for Dopey and our cruise, Eve having this whole section amongst all of our bags, while Sarah and James are just comfortably up there. Or imagine, and this is what's gonna happen this and weekend. We put stuff underneath. Not while it's down like this. Up there? Up there we can. Yeah. Imagine them not there and those seats down, this thing being packed with all of our fun stuff. This is gonna help, like we're bringing a bunch of stuff to storage this weekend. Mm -hmm. We're bringing our last piece of furniture from Christine and Grants in this, back to our apartment. This is why we got it. And then watch, you just hit normal. Boom, chicka, boom, chicka, boom, da, boom, da, boom, boom, da, boom, 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 boom. Stow and go, yeah. baby. Stow and go. The black leather is also something that we loved and also key for like not living in Florida anymore. Right. Oh, I remember the remote other, start. Yeah, the remote start. That was the big thing. So like in Florida, we will be able to have the AC bumping. Have the AC bumping. And then here in the winter, we'll be able to have the, the heat bumping before we get into. I had a minivan growing up. This is like, this technology was really cool and like, I got picked up in my minivan, my new minivan in like fourth grade. And this is a used car. It's a 2019 Chrysler Pacifica. You got two cup holders there and little storage there. So that's nice. One click for two cup, another click to open up the storage. Nice. An additional little storage here. And Peter's got that by him up there too. So here's the dashboard, pretty basic. You can configure that screen like a million different ways. It's amazing. Um, you have voice control, phone options, menu options, um, cruise control settings. Now this cool touchscreen, apparently Chrysler is like well known for its U Connect option. So when we, when I'm done working, cause I have a meeting in a little bit, we're gonna connect the phone, we're gonna drive out to the suburbs and, and visit Christina and Grant to show them this and hopefully see their new couches. Um, but you can have all the presets, all the fancy doodads. When you put it in reverse, it's got 360 version, like 360, so you can choose front, back, fisheye. It's got like this fake top view because it like merges the photos. It, I haven't tried it yet, but it's got park assist, so like it can help you parallel park. And then down here, you've got USB auxiliary, another USB, and then you've got your Blu-ray player, Blu-ray DVD player and then this cool storage area for just more fun storage space down there, as well as that space, as well as this space, as well as these cup holders, as well as, I keep, I've, I've not been able to open that smoothly yet, as well as this little space. Perfect for a phone and a wallet. We are not car reviewers by any means. So if we forgot anything or you have questions about anything specific about the car, be sure to leave a comment below. I will be aware of all the comments that come in and I'll be sure to answer them. Or you can always message us on social media. So if I go to controls here, I've got the driver heated seat, vented seat, heated wheel. Ooh. Passenger heated seat, vented wheel. But there's this cool, I already did it so I don't think it's gonna do anything. But with the with the third row headrests, I can actually hit this button that drops them so I can have a better view. Yeah unobstructed view. Yeah, which actually like if no one's back there, you don't need this the the headrests. We will need to figure out our new configuration with the this little boy and the the new baby and how we want like if they're both going to go here. We got a little bit of time. Peter's first parallel park job a success. Ooh, look at that. Fancy. So you can close them in. Mm-hmm. So people don't knock them off. This is how it looks from the outside. Peter says that these are nice wheels. They look nice. So there's a camera right here. And then there's a camera right there. Cool. And because we live in Illinois, we actually have to get 
a, a front license plate holder here. Uh, we're back home, finished with the work day. And we have this on his background noise and here's the greatest scene in all eight movies, I think. I think. Ooh. I love it. Ooh! Someone just woke up from a nap and we're getting sweatshirted up. Lady, did you grow more hair during your nap? I think he did. He's a big kid. We're going to the bookstore. So before we head to the south side in our new car to check out, hopefully, Christina and Grant's couch. They're supposed to yeah. get delivered, but it's not delivered yet. <laughs> it's not right in the day, but it's um, like the end of the day. He just woke up from a nap and we're going to go to the bookstore because I want to check out this Stanley Coochie book. He loves you. And I'm going to finish up the Chicago Marathon vlog. Which I'm excited to watch. Sarah's all like, it's a really good vlog. It is. I go to the bookstore. I look for a book for you too. <laughs> Creepy kid. Hey, who's the coolest kid in town, Jamesy? Huh? All right, here we are at a local bookstore, unabridged. I'm coming to check out that book right there, Taste by Stanley Tucci. And then there's like a book or two I want to check out for this little guy. Um, they're, apparently they have a signed copy, maybe. So maybe we'll get fancy and get a signed copy of Stanley Tucci's book. You see all the books? Wow. Are they wonderful? We're gonna get you some. Let's just find the one author I'm looking for. Yes. We're gonna go home and look at your books. <laughs> uh, he was very excited about the books. I did pick up Stanley Tucci's book, Taste. Um, so I'm very excited about that. Looks like an easy, quicker read. Um, it was fun going to the bookstore with Jamesy. But we're gonna go back, if Sarah's done with the vlog, getting it up, which I'm very excited to watch that one. Um, I think we're gonna hit the road down to the south side. Um, but if not, James and I'll probably just hang out. I don't know if we gotta figure out dinner or something. Jamesy. <laughs> We're back in the car. Typical Dan Ryan traffic. Ooh, I know we left like pretty close to the time everyone else was leaving downtown. Well, I think the White Sox game just got out. Oh, I didn't even realize they were playing today. I know they played last night. Christina made a glorious stuffed pepper soup situation for dinner tonight. What a dear. Do you love all them? That's so nice. One of the things I'm most excited for about that minivan is how the second and third row go down. And it's basically like a pickup truck. This weekend, we are clearing out the apartment. We we're getting all of those bins in the kitchen and dining room into storage. And I'm finally gonna be able to bring the last dresser and headboard that were Mr. and Mrs. Ryan's to our apartment. But I'm nervous that the dresser actually won't fit because I haven't measured it out in person. Like I looked up dimensions online of the opening of the Pacifica before we bought it. But now that it's here, like I'm gonna measure the dresser and the headboard. I'm gonna go out there and measure the doorway, like the back gate of the Pacifica. Fingers crossed. So here is the headboard, which is actually very massive. And then the dresser here. The dresser, if I remember, I think it's like the width is secretively pretty large. And so is that. I'm nervous about that, but that might be able to like attach to the top if it's tarped and everything. I don't know. Well, let me measure it. We're breaking the Halloween rules. I'm saying, I'm saying in this household, because Luca, he's as big of a fan as we are. Christmas is forever since we opened up the gate. Christina got nice new carpet, but like the couch was supposed to show up today and it never came. Never came. Never came. Here's. Wait, where's the paint swatch? They're painting.
ask me how far I've gotten into Stanley Tucci's taste. How far? Two pages in. You're in the middle of another book. I'm just like your every average old book reader. We really need to get our. We were in Evergreen again today. I could have gotten. I had pictures printed, sent there. It's good to be home. Town Troubadour. It's good to be home. We know what our goals are. We know what we hope to accomplish. And believe me, it's the most exciting and challenging assignment we've ever tackled at Walt Disney Productions.